The number one reason cited for why marriages fail is communication. And the number two reason is finances, which probably 90% of it has to do with communication and how the couple is communicating about their finances. Otherwise, how could you explain how some couples manage to weather the storms of very difficult financial situations, whereas others fail as soon as it happens? It all boils down to communication. So one aspect of communication has to do with how you listen to your spouse when they're talking. Do you listen to respond or do you listen to hear? Most people, when they're in a conversation, listen not to hear what the person is saying, but rather to respond and to get their word in, their opinion in. Part of the reason for this is that people seem to be afraid of silence today. But I want to challenge you to learn to listen in order to hear what your spouse is saying. And don't be afraid of silence. If you are truly listening, listen to understand. Listen like there's going to be a test on what they're saying. Listen like your life depends on it because it very well could. And then when they're done speaking, you'll know exactly what they said and you'll know exactly how you need to respond. You don't need to worry about thinking about what you want to respond while your spouse is speaking. Learn to listen, to hear, and not to respond. And you may just save your marriage. I'm Penina Taylor, and this is Just a Thought on Marriage.